we are able to offer a vegan gelato to customers. I think it's really exciting and uh, something worthwhile knowing more about. Hi folks, this is Calogero. Uh, welcome back to our Creative Flavor Focus. I like to focus on uh, making a vegan gelato. It's very interesting because it's a growing market. I love hazelnuts myself, but it's also a very popular flavor in the market. A gelato showcase is judged by a few of the flavors and hazelnut is definitely one of them. Uh, so we're going to be using a, a no sugar added pure hazelnut paste. It marries very well with your non-dairy uh, liquid. Today we're going to be using an oat milk. It will go really, really nice with our hazelnut paste that we're doing today. I make sure I use the full fat version, if you can get your hands on that. The full fat will just lend a little bit more creaminess to the experience and to the mouthfeel. So it will make a slight difference. Vegan gelato base, sugar, invert sugar, and our hazelnut paste. Our oat milk, we're gonna warm it up a bit and we're gonna combine all of our dry ingredients. So the invert sugar, we're gonna be placing with our oat milk. Invert sugar is an anti-crystallizing uh, agent. It will ensure that the whole vegan gelato will remain creamy and soft. About 65 degrees Celsius is fine. The invert sugar is an antifreeze and it will uh, ensure that uh, the temperature of the gelato will be not as cold and also remain a little bit more creamier. Warming it up is to dissolve the sugar and give the dry ingredients a chance to absorb the moisture, coagulate and really dissolve. We're going to add our dry ingredients to our warm uh, oat milk, incorporate it, make sure there's no lumps. Place it in here. You want to make sure that we are emulsifying the whole mixture. Let it rest for about 20 minutes. This will ensure that our gelato in the machine will capture all the air and give it a nice overrun. And then we're going to add our hazelnut paste. Perfect. This hazelnut paste is really nice because it doesn't have any sugar. It's not a praline. Nice medium roast. So this will give it a nice beautiful flavor. So here we have some um, shelled hazelnuts. Um, we just placed them on a sheet pan. Uh, we're gonna lightly roast them in the oven just to get a little, um, to, to enunciate the nuttiness and also enhance the color a little bit. They will lend to be a nice garnish on the gelato and also a nice flavor when you eat your gelato. We're gonna place these in the oven. This is what the hazelnuts looked like after we uh, roasted them. They were in the oven for 10 minutes, at, like I said earlier, at 325 degrees Fahrenheit. I think it's, they have a nice color. They're going to be more crunchy and they add a nice touch to our vegan gelato. Here's the vegan gelato. I think it looks great. Beautiful alternative of a regular gelato. Enjoy it. Until next time, see you. I'm not introducing myself, right? No, not now.